Is it nine o'clock at night and am I about to show you how to make a dirty Dr. Pepper? Yes, yes I am. You're gonna need several ingredients and some of them aren't actual ingredients. They're just a cup full of ice. I have a cup full of ice. A dirty Dr. Pepper has no alcohol in it. Also, by the way, usually on Tuesdays, I post Home Chef Throwdown stuff. This is toasted marshmallow, two pumps. You can vote for Home Chef Throwdown once a week, which means even though there is no Home Chef Throwdown this week, you can still vote for me. And also, please, a note, a note to our friends out there. Be kind to my fellow Home Chef Throwdown people. I have been hearing reports that certain members of our collective have been bullying other creators in the Home Chef Throwdown, and that I do not stand for. When I am joking about taking Dan down, I just wanna beat him in this competition. There's no hard feelings. It is all jokes. It is all good. We are fine. Let's make our Dr. Pepper. That being said, I don't think that anybody else as a part of this competition realizes that I could ask you to vote for me this week to help boost my chances to win, but I'm not gonna ask you to vote for me this week. I'm gonna ask you to vote for anybody but me and including Dan. You can vote for him if you want because I don't want him getting hate over this. This was a feud that we created out of fun. This is white chocolate syrup. Apparently in certain states where there's a high Mormon population, I believe Utah, they make dirty Dr. Peppers or dirty sodas like this. Like it's like a, it's like a float situation because they can't drink alcohol and they can't drink coffee. So this is like the replacement. And I don't like coffee that much. And I've been drinking this like it's my job. It's becoming a problem. I'm in love and obsessed with this. This is creamy coconut Dr. Pepper. You just put as much or as little as your heart desires of your soda of your choice. And then you put creamer, half and half creamer, whatever you've got. Now I'm a lactose intolerant bitch. So I will be using oat milk creamer. This is planet oat, oat milk creamer. It's French vanilla. I've never had this kind. Last time I had just like plain kind. Um, ooh, this smells good. We're going to see if this is delicious. It almost tastes like an ice cream float and that's all I want in life. And if I could have my coffee taste like an ice cream float, I would drink coffee, but coffee tastes bitter. And I like sweet things because I'm a Christmas elf. I didn't think it could get better, but this makes it better. French vanilla. So if you want to make a dirty Dr. Pepper, that's what it is. That's how you make it. And you don't have to ask me twice to show you how to make a dirty Dr. Pepper. I will make it for you every single time. Also, vote for me. Click the link in my bio. There's a whole bunch of links there. The one that says Home Chef Throwdown is the one you want. Go ahead, vote for me. This is cheating. I'm cheating right now. Vote for me to help me cheat to win. I'm not above cheating. All of the proceeds go to charity. You get free a free vote, but if you want to purchase a vote, it goes to help feed families through lasagna love. If you did not know, now you do. Follow along for more bullshit. And stop bullying my friends.